Today, I wanted to play a little bit of a different game. It's called Parkasaurus. It's similar to like a roller coaster tycoon or any other tycoon type of game, except for in this theme park, it's actually a dinosaur park. So, so let's just hit new game. I don't really think that we're going to need to do a tutorial. We can probably just do a standard game just to start out. I'm going to skip the tutorial. Probably not a good idea, but... I feel like it's going to be pretty self-explanatory once we head in here. So I do like the colors. Very colorful game. I like it a lot. All right. So what's this? Oh, so it's like a little picture book. All right. So it looks like the dinosaurs crashed the ship. <laughs> All right. The dinosaurs crashed the ship from space. Okay. What's the name of your park? We're just going to call it Tussie Park. So the camera controls. Hold down the right mouse button to pan the camera. Pan camera six times. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so it looks like we have a fresh slab here to start our park. Use the mouse wheel to zoom in and out. Cool. The controls feel really good in this game. Press Q or E to rotate the camera. Simple enough. All right, so it looks like we need a wood fence to start off right in the corner here. Whoa, no, go back. Okay, nice. We can literally just click around here. And then, okay, I want to place it. Simple enough. All right, so we're just going to build. I guess we'll just build around where they want us to. And then I would assume that you can just kind of freely do it as you go. All right, now we need a door. The door can pretty much go so that the customers, I think, would enter here. That's the entrance. So the door, like for our veterinarian, kind of want it away from that path, but close enough so I don't have to walk too far here i piloted the crash ship into your planet your money is very shiny we should be collecting as much of this stuff as possible i invented a way to collect these coins in bins called donation boxes from packs all right so we need donation boxes hey, what am i clicking here there we go i do like how it tells you what you can click too that's a huge help all right, so we can rotate it. Let's put a donation box right when they enter or exit because we need to get our money. Oh, we can only put one. Let's get you a first dinosaur. This is very exciting for everyone involved. So should we get a Stegosaurus or a Triceratops? Hmm. Let's go with a Stegosaurus for right now. Okay, so we have our egg. <laughs> okay, so you can just place the little egg to hatch right here. All right, that's our first dinosaur. All right, let's go into the town. Oh, this is cool. It's a little veggie store. Whoops. All right, we're in our veggie store here. So we need to buy six plants. for our baby dino. And then we have a meat store, probably for like T-Rexes. Look at that cute little T-Rex right on the right on the top of the building. All right, and then egg store, hats. Oh, that's cool. So you can buy eggs for new dinosaurs? Or what is this? Hmm, I'm sure they'll tell us eventually. Wow, this is cool. Oh, I wonder if it's like archaeology where you can like dig up bones to discover new dinosaurs. Dude, this game has so much in it. Go back to the town. Hats. Dapper dinos. Oh my gosh. Wait, so you can like, I bet you can like dress up your dinosaurs. Dude, what? A gem store imperfect imperfect gems hmm gem hut so i wonder if that has to do with like unlocking gems or if you have to like dig for them 
That's cool. There are many different types of dino feeders. Upgrading and researching new dino feeders give various bonuses to your dinosaurs. Your new dino is a vegetarian. Okay. Small vegetarian feeder. All right, little guy. Second you're born, you're going to start munching on those veggies. Caring for your dino. Caring for your dino best friends is a lot of work. The dialogue in this game is really weird. Employees are great help by doing many of the tasks in the park. Veterinarians are the primary caregivers for your dinos. Let's hire a veterinarian. I think that the dialogue is kind of funny in this game because it's like the dinosaur talking. So it's supposed to be like kind of cute, I guess. All right, where are we at here? Resumes. Okay. Tegius. A Dietrin? What is up? Look at this guy. Is that is that his hair? Ba -bow -bow. My name is Aditrin. Nice to meet you. Quadon? Oh my goodness. Lampodicel? Dude, these names are ridiculous. Okay, who should we hire? Let's see. We have a level two, a level one. All right, so we need to hire a level two. We know that. Let's check out speed. So this guy's a level three on speed. She, uh, Tegius is a level four on ability and then three on personality. Personality and ability, I feel like are huge, but we also, we, we, we need everything here. So who's like right in the middle? Two, four, three. Um, I feel like the first one is probably the best bet for our money. Tegius. She looks like the best vet to hire, um, right away. So cost per day. Okay. Let's hire her. You are hired. Okay. So we have to assign her tasks. We have janitors. Maybe we should make money first or... No, I feel like I should hire a janitor first. Look at this guy. Earth. Well, Earth A. It's not a bad name, buddy. Okay, so he's really quick. He's just pretty much hyper. So I don't think we need... Maybe we don't have to hire... We're, we're going to hold off on that for now. We Okay, so we have our vet. Let's go back to our park. Okay, it's nighttime. Click the fence or double click the ground in the exhibit to open the exhibit pane. Okay. Okay, so you sec select the object. Drag grass tiles. All right, so we got to fill this up with grass for our little uh, stegosaurus. Okay. Add water to your exhibit to morph into a rainforest biome. Okay. So when you click like the exhibit pane, it looks like it's showing the type of biome that it needs. So we need a rainforest biome. So we have our water tool. All right, little guy. Trying to think where, maybe we can put it like right in the middle. That is so cool. How much do we have to build? We have to morph the biome. So maybe we have to make it a little bigger. We'll go like that. And then we'll wrap it like that. And I want to bring it like up here. So that this little guy has plenty of water. There we go. That's pretty cool, man. So he's got a little swimming pool and then the vet can kind of go in the middle of it. Every biome has an ideal ratio of trees. Okay, so we're going to need to put... It's pretty much telling us, like, what the next step to build our our exhibit here is for the dinosaur. All right, these are the feeders. Okay. How do we go into trees? Oh, here we go. All right. So we'll put some trees. Maybe around the rainforest. I think that will make it look pretty nice. Maybe 
could put some like here. How many do we need? I think we have to put quite a bit. Yeah, we do. Maybe like 10. Whoa, that's a big one. I wonder if you can knock them, like demolish them with a right click. No. Let me click here. Okay, so you can. I hope it doesn't cost money. I'm going to leave that tree here though. What is this? Okay, so these are like stats. So what is this? Oh, so the day ended, I think. Okay, so that shows like our earnings and that kind of thing. You know, pretty much the whole earnings of the day, the stats of the dinosaur, the attendance. This is really cool. This, it shows staff, the buildings, the guests, shows everything on the park for that day. That's very, very helpful. Okay. Tuesday in the spring. We got to finish our trees here, though. All right, we got a big tree. Put one there. Maybe I can put like a big tree right there, right in the entrance. That's nice. That looks pretty cool. Oh, wait, what is this? What is this water? Oh, wait, do I need to water the trees? Oh, maybe I have to hire somebody to do that. Okay, it still wants us to put more trees down for some reason. All right, I think it just wants us to keep building more and more trees to help the biodiversity, which makes sense, but okay, it does. Wow, we have to build a lot of trees here. Like a lot of trees. Our little guy needs as much trees as he can possibly get. I mean, it is a rainforest, so that would make sense. It's supposed to be a forest. Oh, look at that. Is that our... Wait, look at this little guy. He just hatched. It's our first dinosaur. Wow, look at him go. Right through the rainforest. He's hiding. Let me see if I can... There he is. All right, he's in the water. Nice. All right, so now we got to build some bushes here. Got to build plenty of bushes for this guy. I don't want to take up too much of that water. And now we have to build some rocks. I'm just going to put that right there. I'll put those like kind of in the corner out of the way. Because they're kind of ugly. Okay. So, oh, what is this? What is it? Oh, wait, he's crying. Time to open the park so guests can visit. Cool. All right, let's try and make... Hold on, I want to check on this little guy. He doesn't look very happy. He was crying. Maybe he's hungry. Let me... Where are you, buddy? He need... He's not social. So he needs a mate or a friend. Okay. No, he's happy. I mean, he's half happy. Oh, well, I got to open the park. But first, I want to make sure... Money first so that we can actually make sure everything's running okay. Let's try and get another donation box. I actually want to put I want to put a lot of donation boxes in here because we got to make that money, baby, you know what I'm saying? Shoot, I should have put I actually wanted to put one here and I wanted to put one there because I want to demolish this one's kind of out of place. So I want to demolish this one. All right, there we go. Delete. Oh, delete that. Okay, I had to click on it. All right. So we have two donation boxes there. And one right here. I want to see if I can delete this path that's just poking out from that donation box. No, I can't. Okay. That's okay. Oh, well. Let's see here. Let's open our park. Click on the emission booth. The building colors we can change. What should we change it to? It doesn't really change that much. Oh, I see. Let's change it to a little more fun colors here. Purple and green look nice. Maybe make this the green. Or 
or like a blue and then I want to change that roof uh I think it looked okay like a baby blue a darker blue okay that looks good all right, we just opened our park. It is the next day, Wednesday in the spring, and we have to hire a janitor. So let's go up to our resumes here. Oh, geez. Marconin. Walatis. Ganserek. Baby Loney. Oh, man, we got to hire Baby Loney. What are her stats? Oh, my goodness. Is that a man or a woman? Kyrie. Oh, geez. I don't know about Kyrie, you guys. What about Baby Loney? Let's see what the stats are. I want to hire a level two. Baby Loney has in between like average stats. Kyrie, though, is a two, four, three. Okay, so it's the same. Dude, we got to hire ba Bab Baby Loney. All right, Baby Loney is cheap as well. Kind of, not really. All right, Baby Loney, you're hired. I have to watch the janitor clean the garbage three times. Okay. So let's go back to our part. Because you know we're going to have garbage here. Go to your park and build things. All right. Let's build. Oh, look at that. Oh, we got our first customer, you guys. Look, they're waving at the dinosaur. They're so happy. Well, this game is pretty cool, man. Let's build, like, trash cans and stuff. Let's just get, like, the... Okay, outhouse. We definitely need some bathrooms in here. So, we're going to put a bathroom. Because, you know, we don't want people going to the bathroom right here. Right at the entrance. So, when they come in, they leave a donation. They're like, oh, man, I got to go to the bathroom real quick. All right, we have garbage bins. Definitely put garbage bins at the exit. Uh, we'll put one right next to the trash can. Nice. I want to put a garbage bin right here, right by that path that we tried to get rid of. Cool. There's a garbage bin there. So we're just putting up the basic stuff here. We got a little bench. I don't want the bench right by the garbage. We'll put a bench right there. That looks nice. And a gazebo. Should we buy a gazebo? No, oh, why not? Right by the bench, right? That looks nice. All right, we already got people sitting at the benches here. All right, we have to click on the janitor. Where's he at? Is this the janitor inside the... What are you doing inside the biome, brother? All right, he's got to clean up the junk. I got to move him. All right, you guys, we're, we're at 388 bucks on the day. So people are paying for the admission, and I think they're leaving tips. I'm sure we can find that out later. All right, we have to hire security now. So we're doing all the hiring... Is this the security? No, this is. Okay, we have Ephes, Ephes, Walla, Hesus, really? Tarda? Okay, let's see. 252, 231. Eh. These are more um, genuine type of security that we're going to hire. So we'll hire. Tarda. Okay. So we need to hire security just in case the dinosaurs break loose somehow. Okay. So we have to go through like a security training. So what we have to do, it wants us to pick up a dinosaur and re the, release the dino in the exhibit. So we're going to see how this goes as soon as we do this. I think we're training our security. So where's our little dino? And I need to request it to be tranquilized. All right, we got him. So we have to request. Okay, there's the little dart. Aw. All right, so the vet. Is it the vet? No, Tarda. So security has been requested. Look at him. L look at Tarda go. Look at his little hat. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my God. He's got the gun. No. All right, so he's tranquilizing the dino. So we gotta we gotta put him to sleep for a second just for training. All right, that's been checked off. So now we have to pick the dino up. But where is he? Let me rotate. Can I rotate the camera? I forget how to rotate. 
we press E and we can kind of look around. Where is that cute little guy? He's supposed to be knocked out. Where the heck is he? Oh, he's right here. This is his, his like little cage or her Zola. Okay, now we have to release her into the park. Everybody run! The dinosaur's loose! Look out! Watch, everyone's probably gonna freak out now. Oh, there are no customers, I don't think, in here. Alright, so we're just- we're, we're going through security training still. Okay, the day is over. Our profits are- or our cash flow. It's almost 2000 bucks, 1995. Not bad. I'm trying to get up to like 5 grand a day or who knows, man. When our park's huge, if we're already at 2 grand a day with one little exhibit with one baby dinosaur, I'm sure we can get up to like 20, 30, 50 grand a day. So, okay. We have our reviews here as well. We have 12 reviews for the day. We only have a 2-star rating. Let's see what the reviews say. Seemed bored, more like Garbageville. What? Is your food 100% free range local? It was tidy. It was cool. Cool. I saw a dino. I also read my post on Dino Book. Honestly, I was surfed my phone. I just surfed my phone all day. Okay, well, you're probably a. Your name is Wall. Of course, you surfed your phone all day. You probably stare at the wall all day. Meh. Snooze. It was okay. All right, so that's actually not too bad. I don't know how it's only two stars, but we just opened the park. I mean, come on, give us a break. We're still training here. Just just give us some time. We're only on our fourth day here. So we'll go up until Friday before we end it. All right, so let's click on our Zola. I think, okay, we I think we got to put her back in here. All right, so we got to... We got to put her back in here. There you go. All right, she's back in the park. We have to build a science building now. So this is where the research is going to be done. Let's move it. Let's put our science building somewhere out of the way, but somewhere not too far. Um... But I want to put it kind of like behind the scenes, if that makes sense. So we'll have all the research done right off the street here. All right, we have our science building here. I would assume we have to hire a scientist. Okay. Reticons. Recon. Or Racone. Ooh, I like his beard. Kyra, I like your hairdo, brother. Looks like leaves. 522. You already know we got to hire this guy. This guy's a G. 137 bucks a day, not bad. All right, so we have to find our scientist. I think this is him. Yep, Kyra. We got to place him on a worker spot. So we got our scientist, and we need to place him at the research here to dig for fossils, I guess. Okay, and he's generating science. Pretty cool. We also have to get food. I got a notification where we have to get food because we ran out. So I think we have to buy more vegetation for this little guy. And let's go back here. I don't think I have to do anything with it. I think that it's okay the way that it is after I purchase it. So we're going to wait for this guy to generate the science for the day. And let's see, no garbage in the park. What that what that rating call us? Uh, garbageville, more like garbageville. Okay. All right, so we just got our science for the day. Time to expand the park with more dinosaur best friends. Use the portal portal to go dig up skulls and footprints to be used in the egg store. That's cool. That is cool. So this is the portal. Look for a Stegosaurus. Oh, so you can choose the unlocked ones to look for. All right, we'll go Stegosaurus. So we open the portal. 
So are we digging right now? Oh, so this is kind of looking for them. Have the expedition team arrive at the dig site. Exploring takes a little time, so explore your park and return later. That's cool. All right, so we're pretty much doing research here to get some more dino friends. That's awesome. All right, so we're exploring for more dinos. Let's see what we can do here. Should we build some stuff to attract customers? A balloon shop, a sweet tooth, and a dino dogs. Oh my God, so this is just concession. All right, so we're gonna build a little concession like right when we get into the park here. I wonder if I can build a path or it might do it for us. Concrete fire, that's fence, path, here we go. The concession can just be standard. I don't wanna to pay too much for a path like that. So we're gonna have our concession come right here. So we'll connect it, that way it matches and it's not uneven. Okay. Okay, so the day ended. Let's see what we got. Not a lot of money. There wasn't really anyone at the park for some reason. May have been because we were doing stuff and it was a Thursday. I don't know. Maybe Thursdays aren't busy. So it's almost a weekend. Or we can count Friday as a weekend. Fridays are always exciting. So we have to build our little concession path. Okay. I'm going to extend it at least out to here. Because I want enough room for whatever else we're gonna build. So we have a little balloon shop. All right. And a sweet tooth. I would assume that's like a little ice cream stand. Let's put the sweet tooth. Um, let's put it right there because we're gonna extend this this little corner. And then a dino dogs. All right, so we'll put the dino dogs there and then we will increase our path so it doesn't look, you know, ridiculous. So let's put a basic path all along here. Oops. Um, yeah, that's fine because we're, we're going to come out here anyways. It doesn't really matter. Eventually, we'll have so much more stuff to look at. All right, I think we're done exploring. So we need the expedition team to arrive and dig. Wait, do we dig here? Oh, so we're digging. Okay, so we have 36 items left. So I think it's it's almost like, like a lottery, kind of. Like you only get a few tries. But it looks like we're doing pretty well. Wait, is that it? We're done? Oh no, I have to hire more scientists to do this. Can Kyra do it? No, look how close we are to a dinosaur too. I think it'll save our progress, so let's just return home. Uh, I th Actually, maybe we have to hire another scientist to get this done. Let's hire one more, because I want to make sure. Pony? Let's hire... Um, She's really quick, though. I want to hire Waladra. All right, buddy, you're hired. Let's see if we can do more digging. All right, we have to explore first, though. So let's go back to the park. Give us donations. We want money. We have dinosaurs to feed. What's this guy doing? The scientist. Wait, isn't that him? Yeah, so that's our new scientist. This is... What's his name? Waladra? Come here, brother. Why can't I click on him? There we go. Waladra, okay. I don't need to move him at the moment. Let's see how many people we got in the park. We don't have a lot of people in the park. We gotta kinda extend this stuff. Somebody come buy some food or something. Can we build more stuff here? A hat stand. Tom's wonton truck. Banana stand, dude. Burger Bonanza. All right, so the concession is going to be booming eventually. We can put more wildflowers. 
Let's put some wildflowers right here to make the park extra pretty. People are already cheering. They like the park. Put some of these cute little bushes right there. Pretty cool. A park is coming along, baby. Let's put some of these like that. All right. Yeah, you better just donate. We want them donations. This place ain't cheap. Can we do more digging? All right. We're almost done exploring. We have another scientist. Haha. <laughs> it looks like people are buying the balloons. Wait, is this a floating dinosaur balloon? Wow, look at that. That's so cool. I'm on one of those in real life. I like how they sh actually like show the balloons there. And what is this? Ice cream or cotton candy? Probably something from the sweet shop, right? Are we almost done exploring? All right, we're almost done exploring. We have to find a few more things and then we have to buy a dinosaur egg so we can get this, this little guy a friend. All right, here we go. We're, we're going to do some more digging. We have to find one more footprint. All right, so we found a skull. We have to find two of those. Nice. We found two more. So we found three. So now we have to find one footprint. That's it. That's all we have to find. There we go. Oh, are you kidding me? Right when we run out. All right. Day is over, and we made a total of $1,056. So opening day, we made more money, clearly, but we did a lot better than we did the previous day. So the weekend's coming up. We're about to get everybody in. Hopefully, they can see our dinosaur. Hopefully, we can get another dinosaur in here in a second. And look at that. Four stars at Tussie Park already. I'm a prince. Can you help me get my money? What is that supposed to mean? Wow, Tussie Park had a great food had great food options. The park was a bit dull. Okay, all right, people are still talking that smack. So, just give us some time. It's Saturday, the first weekend. We're almost done exploring. It's a beautiful, bright Saturday. How's our little Dino doing? How you doing, Zolo? You're doing good. Nice and happy. Okay. We need to get some more dinos in here. I think we have to go to the town and purchase a dinosaur egg. First, we need more plants. All right, let's go to the town here real quick. See how we get dinosaur eggs. Okay, so you have to explore in order to... That's what I thought. In order to, you know pretty much get these dinosaurs so we have to match the dna to get the dinos so let's go in here let's dig one more time we just have to find one footprint that's literally all we have to do so let's click on kyra all right we need a footprint that's it got it now we have to buy an egg from the egg store cool i think we can buy it with a gem it said Nope. Go back to the store. All right, here we go. So, what should we get? What can we get? So, we can get a Stegosaurus. I think that's it. So, let's create a Stegosaurus. Apparently, dinosaurs come from chickens. Okay. And I think we have one. Do we have an egg? Yes, we have a Stegosaurus egg. Nice. So I wonder if we should put the Stegosaurus in the same biome here. Okay, I can't find the egg for some reason for our Stegosaurus. So as of right now, we just have to earn money at our park. And it looks like we got 800 some bucks for the day. I wonder if I should put more concession stands out. Or maybe I should put like lighting for at night. So the park's nice and lit. We'll put some there. And there. Want to make our park nice and bright. All right, we got our lights lit up, so that'll help. I think we're racking in the dough right now, you guys. Maybe I should build a path around here. 
so that people can actually walk to see the dinosaur. That's cool. All right, so they can walk around, maybe look at the science center a little bit. Wait, what did we just unlock right here? An employee building? Maybe we already had that. So what is this for? This costs $2,000. I don't even have enough money. Holy crap, dude. Should I put like more donation boxes out or what? I wonder if we have to advertise for the part. All right, we got five seconds left. We'll just end it right here. We need the money. All right, we got about 1800 bucks. Hearts gain, science gain. I see how it's working now. So that's really cool. So the science is like a huge part of this game. So we have a heat map. The water heat map displays the wetness of an exhibit. Access this view. Okay. I'm going to skip that for now. We have a problem. One of the employees was messing around in the science lab and the time portal malfunctioned. It opened a portal to future time where the world is only hot dogs. Long story short, we have a surplus of hot dogs and we need to sell them to clear out some storage. Okay. So we have a little mission here. We have to sell 15 hot dogs today. So we we can increase the wiener size. Let's go big hot dogs. Those cost more. Okay, it looks like we have enough science to get our sous chef. So let's load this one up. And let's put it out there in the concession part. So let's see. The Tulum Taco Shop. And we actually have Tom's wonton truck now as well. Awesome. All right, so we're going to put these out here. Because I know the concession stands, $5,000 a cost. You guys, we can't even build these yet. This one's $1,500. So we can build another... No, wait, we already have a hot dog stand. How much is this? $1,750? Okay, so we need more money, which is okay. We'll get it. All right, we only need to sell two more hot dogs here. Looks like we have a 14th customer, and then this is our last final customer. Come on, baby, buy that hot dog. You got a balloon. Come on. Oh, she didn't even buy one. Really, dude? You're going to have the last person walk up to the hot dog stand and not even buy a hot dog? We have to buy one more hot dog, and then we're complete with that mission. Come on. All right, can this be it? Is this our last customer? Come on, dude. Guy in the suit. There we go. All right, so we just got an Ankylosauria footprint. Oh, wait, we do have an egg. So that's our little inventory bag. We could have made a dinosaur this whole time, you guys. Okay, let's do this. Okay, so this is where, like, our food for, like, our plants and all that are. So I have to plop that into the biome, I think. Or I have to give that to that little dino. No, I place it in the feeder. But I don't know where I put that feeder for this guy. Is this it? No, that's not it. Let me look around here. I want to see where the feeder is because I have to put the plants in it. Or I can just build another one. <laughs> I don't know where that feeder went. So let me just build another one here if I'm able to. Um, meat feeder, vegetarian feeder. So I'm going to put a feeder right there just so that I know where it's at. Oops. Okay, so the, the day just ended. We got about a thousand some bucks. Not bad. I'm really worried about this food though. I want to get these plants that we bought in there. Oh wait, maybe you don't even do that. Okay, so the feeder just goes about the plants by itself, I guess. So let's take this egg. Let's give this guy a little friend here. And we have another footprint. And that's what the scientists use to dig for the dino eggs. Cool. So this is our new dinosaur, which is another Stegosaurus. Cool, man. So that little guy is going to hatch eventually. And I think we have enough money 
to buy our dino dogs, or I mean, sorry, excuse me, our Tom's wonton truck. So we're going to place Tom's wonton truck right there, right smack down on the side. Come and get your Tom's wontons. Let's increase the path here to pretty it up a little bit. So we'll build the path like this. And then we'll have like some benches and more, more area for people to go around so that they can eat their food. They can enjoy the beautiful view. Put a trash can right here. We don't even have enough money to build a trash can. Are you kidding me? We're going to have to put... We're going to have to put donation boxes everywhere because every cent counts. They cost five bucks. We're at negative six dollars right now. So we have to wait till the end of the day. I'm pretty sure that's okay. So we're waiting on our dinosaur egg. Let's see what, where we're at with the science here. So our science is really low. All right, you guys, our second dino is ready. Oh, he's crying. It's a newborn. Wah! Oh, and he's pooping. Looks like he pooped right when he was born. And look, our first Stegosaurus, Zola, she's all happy. She loves him. His name's Hudson. That's a nice name. Okay. He's a crying little baby, and Zola's giving him some, some attention. She's kissing him. That's her baby. Uh-oh. What's the vet doing? Oh, that's the janitor. He's cleaning up the poop. You better do your job, buddy. Clean that poopy. Zola is overwhelmed by the lack of privacy. Hmm. So it looks like Zola's upset because she doesn't have enough privacy. Maybe she needs big trees. Let's see here. I wonder how we can help with the privacy here of our dinosaurs. She's overwhelmed, so it looks like she's getting a lot of anxiety here because there are people. Maybe we need to give Zola like a little private lot. Maybe have like the water more protected. I don't know. That's kind of hard to say how I'm supposed to give her more privacy at the moment. So what is this? A little dig spot? Okay, so we just got a thero theropoda skull. Whatever that is. So that will help with... Dino skulls are used to purchase the dino eggs. Cool. So we can get more dino eggs for that. Right now, my main concern is our profits. So our profits are down. We're in the red. Because I want to make sure that before we end this, we can get the necessary trash cans, more donation boxes around the concession, and make sure everything's set by the end of the week so that come monday we're ready to go all right we're learning science science learn one what is this dino item ready to party cool glasses wait so can i go in here and dress up my dinosaurs oh my gosh i can dude we can give the dinos little glasses all right hold up let's we gotta check this out man what is this? 400 bucks for some little glasses? Okay, we're going to come back to this. I can't afford that. Cannot be dressing up our dinosaurs right now, but that is super cool. We have to get our donation boxes set up over here for a second. So we can put one right. No, I don't want to put one there. That's awkward. Let's put a donation box right there. And... I think we're good. We'll put some more waste baskets over here. We'll put one right there. And that should be good. All right, looking great. Look how lit up this place is. Dude, when this park gets like massive, it's, it's going to be so cool. It's going to be beautiful having all of this lot just full just making so much money look at that we're at 2500 bucks on the day are you kidding me we can get more dinosaurs in 
We definitely need more dinosaurs. We might even be able to like knock some of this out right here and extend this so that our two stegosauruses aren't in this little lot. We definitely are eventually going to want to extend that. I want like all the dinosaurs that are able to be in like the same terrain to actually be together or be able to get to one another all throughout the park. Unless it's like a T-Rex and someone else that just, you know, is going to fight one another. We can't have them fighting. So we'll wait till the day ends to see how much money we got and we'll go from there. Oh, this is kind of cool. You can look in the parking lot and everything to see like how busy the park is. I wanted this whole place to be full of cars. You already know. We can have a separate... I wonder if you can have like another entrance. I don't think that we're going to need another entrance, but we can maybe have the path go three ways, right, left, and then straight. So let's end the day. We got 10 seconds left pretty much. All right, we're, we're making a lot of money. Look at that, 3,200 bucks. Let's see what our reviews are. Three stars. It was clean. It was tidy, so it's clean. The food was amazing. It had great food options, so cleanliness and food. I'm worried about the bathrooms. We can't unlock the bathrooms yet, which is kind of gross. I'm surprised that you can't unlock bathrooms yet. Let's see if we have any really bad ratings here. I stole all the ketchup packs. Oh, uh, thanks, Kron. Thanks for stealing all the ketchup packets and snitching on yourself. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed Parkosaurus. I really want to make a series on this. This will be the channel's very first series. I enjoy it. I love playing Tycoon's games like this. It brings me back to my childhood. I think this is a very, very good optimized game. Very well developed. Great colors. Great music. Great everything, pretty much. So... I'm going to end it there, and if you guys enjoyed the gameplay, make sure to smash that like button. I greatly appreciate it if you did enjoy the gameplay. And as always, if you are new to the channel and you want to stick around, join Team Tussie today. Make sure to subscribe for daily videos, and as always, you guys, I will see you all in the next video. Peace.